Hello beautiful people, I hope you're doing well and welcome back again to OnHow channel. For people that don't know, my name is Enes, I'm working for you. So if you have any questions, any video requests, make sure to drop them below in the comment. I will be happy to make a video for you. And for people that do know, welcome back. And you already know, if you have any questions too, make sure to drop them below. I will be happy to make a video for you as well. Same as the over 100 videos I made now on Shopify customization. Every little thing you're trying to do on Shopify, I'm very confident that you will already find a video I made on that subject. I don't know what the subject is, but I know I already made that video. <laughs> so over 100 videos, mostly requests from subscribers. Some people not even subscribers, but I'm fine with that. Just a like button will help me out and I would really appreciate that. And in this video, I will show you how to hide product prices on all Shopify collections. I did make a sub uh, separate video about how to hide prices or title on only some specific collections and you can actually specify the name by uh, the collections by the name so later I got a request on how to hide the price on all collections somebody have to do it right so it's me now so in this video as I said I will show you how to hide product price on all collections for your Shopify store by using a single line of code no apps nothing like that so without any more talking, let's just jump to it. As you can see, this is the Shopify dashboard and I have here a down team, which is the last version as of now 15, but I do have other teams as well in here. If you can see taste, sense, refresh, spotlight and trade. If you are wondering why is that? Because each trick, each trick I do share on my channel, I do uh, try it on all of these teams to make sure that it does work. I do demonstration in the video on down team, but in behind the scenes, so I don't board people out. I do try it on other uh, teams as well. So if you are using one of these, it should work for you just fine. And this is the case for all my videos. So even if it didn't, just drop me a comment. I will be happy to help you out. So for the second time again, let's just quit talking and let's just get to it. So let me access some uh, Shopify collection. This is the store where I do all the demonstration in here and all the tricks I mean. And if you are interested in how to change the bubble color for the card, make sure to check out my channel. I already made that video. I just posted lately, I think. I'm not sure, I'm not sure. Don't quote me on that. So let's just see this collection in here. So we want to hide the prices on all the products across all the collections. So it will only show the a title for the product and the picture. And if you are wondering if there is some benefits in hiding the prices on collection pages, Yes, there is. There is very good benefits when it comes to hiding the prices because it actually helps algorithms, which is Facebook, Snapchat, TikTok, whatever you use. It helps algorithm to understand that customers actually spend more time on your Shopify store because when they access collection page, they don't, they can't see the price. In order to see the price, they have to actually click on the product so they can see the price. And this will actually be written down by the algorithms. They write down what the viewer does on the Shopify store. If it just take a look and leave, they do write down that. So if they spend more time checking out the product and clicking on this and clicking on that, they do actually write it down. And it's a good thing that it did actually spend more time in your Shopify store and clicked on more things. And I'm getting drifted again off the subject. Let's just get back in here. So we will keep this page open, do the trick, come back and see it. And we will check other collections as well. So the first thing you're going to do is obviously click on the three dots or left customize and click on edit code. Then the next thing you're going to do simply use the search bar at the top left corner. Again, I have to repeat this in each one of my videos. So it will be either base.css or team.css or style.css. All the teams use these three names, base or base.css or team.css or style.css. In my case, I know it's base. I'm going to type in base and it's going to be in assets folder. As you can see, click on it. Then we need to scroll all the way down. It's a huge file. Let me drag this. Here we go. After that, we need a completely new line because we're going to paste in some code. Simply click on front of the bracket or the last thing here and hit enter. And here we go. We are on a completely new line. And to get the code, you need to hire a developer, pay him wait 24 hours and stuff. No need, no need. Just scroll down the description box and you will see a link named as code. Simply click on it and it will take you to this page right here where you're going to see a very short code that will do the magic trick as you can see. And this code is completely free. It's actually shameful to sell something this, this small. Anyway, select the code, right click, copy, get back in here, paste it at the bottom of the page, click on the save, wait a couple of seconds, it's saved, get back to collection page, 
reload the page and ta -da! no more prices on the collection page as you can see let me show you other one as well so you can see this one has one product yeah as you can see no more prices on the collection page and that's how you hide the prices on all collections on your shopify store by using single line of code and if you have any questions make sure to drop them below but for now i think my job is done so thanks for watching catch you on the next one